All right, you clicked on this link because you want to know how to take an x-ray of the trauma elbow series when the patient is flexed and cannot straighten their arm up. And I'm going to show you how to do it perfectly every time. All right, so this is a trauma elbow series done upright when the arm is flexed about 90 degrees. So what we're going to do is they'll come in. We're going to have them turn this way and see the shadow that's going up and down my forearm that's the shadow that you need to see going straight down up and down the forearm because if it is going down the middle then you know that your forearm is 90 degrees to the plate and if it's 90 degrees to the plate then your epicondyles are going to be parallel to the plate and that's what you're trying to get parallel here in this up in this proximal or distal humerus position okay so in this position when they're flexed you're going to take two APs, basically. You're going to take one of the humerus, and then you're going to take one of the forearm. Distal humerus, proximal forearm. So you're going to line up this way, make sure the shadow's going straight down, and then have them with their hand hold their wrist and let them bring it down as far as they can. You'll be surprised. They can usually get, get pretty far down. Whatever their level is, tell them to stop, shoot the x-ray, and then you'll bring them away from the plate a little bit for the other AP. And for this one, you're gonna to try to get the back of their arm onto the plate. So you'll go from here, have them bend at the hips, and like this, okay? And now you have the proximal humerus, or proximal forearm on the plate. And that's good. Now you can shoot the elbow here. Once you've done those two views, and the patient's still like this, then you want to, from this view, have them turn in a little bit to get a 45 degree angle of the radial head. So they're usually coming in about 30 degrees. You're just gonna go about 15 more, get in this position, okay? And then the last one, the last one is going to be you're gonna still have them hold a finger or a hand or a wrist, and you're gonna rotate everything this way, and then bring it out. And they would be holding their hand, but this is what they would be doing. All right, so those are the three ways you can take a trauma elbow series upright when the elbow is flexed. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thanks so much.